everybody, this is 22 Tiger Dude here, and I'm here to review the SpongeBob episode Krusty Crushers, requested by Kevin Pinda. So, Krusty Crushers is about when Mr. Krabs wants to win the money, so he was going to wrestle for the money, but of course, Mr. Krabs, he gets too scared when he sees all of these wrestlers getting beaten up, and so, of course, we all know where this is going. Mr. Krabs has Spongebob and Patrick wrestling out there, but having the two of them thinking that they are just fake wrestling. So in my opinion, I had a lot of fun with Krusty Crushers to be honest with you guys. It's just Spongebob and Patrick out there wrestling. That's really what drives the story of this episode. There's nothing more and it doesn't have to be anything more bigger. The episode realizes what it is. It was just very entertaining throughout. There was never a dull moment when it comes to the Krusty Crushers in my opinion. Spongebob and Patrick were highly enjoyable here. I find it funny that even though the wrestle arena is all real, they still think it's fake wrestling and the wrestlers that they are facing, they think, are just fake wrestlers. There were gags that Spongebob and Patrick were fake wrestling, the wrestlers that I really enjoyed. You know, the one scene where Spongebob was holding the spatula and he's all like, you see this, this represents your face like that was really funny that's the line that always makes me laugh every time i watch this episode patrick has his funny moments too especially when it comes to the bun when he's working out his bun which is a huge what the hell moment but it works honestly it was really funny there was a sleeper hold where the wrestlers were rocking spongebob and patrick that i really enjoyed and honestly it's simple gags like that that just make me really enjoy Krusty Crusher so much. The storyline is very well written. It's very well realized. The writers clearly want to go for a simple episode, as they do for a lot of SpongeBob episodes. And it does work because it's very well executed. It knows what it is. It is funny in some parts. It's very well written, and it's just a very entertaining episode to watch. It makes me smile. SpongeBob and Patrick, they do beat the wrestlers, and that was because Patrick, after working out his bun, <laughs> the wrestlers crack after hitting Patrick's iron bun, which was funny when they're like, oh no, the iron butt. I really enjoyed that. Now, as far as flaws go, there aren't really too many I could really pinpoint because, like I said, it's just a very simple, fun episode. But my major one is definitely, as you can all probably expect, is Mr. Krabs. I didn't really appreciate how Mr. Krabs was using SpongeBob and Patrick just so he could win all of the money. And maybe there were a few times where the episode, um, you know, it got maybe just a little bit repetitive with the whole SpongeBob and Patrick not knowing it's real wrestling. It could get a little bit repetitive after a while with that idea. But what I did really like about this episode is definitely the ending. I'm glad the writers gave it the ending that Mr. Krabs definitely deserved and made it very funny at the same time because after SpongeBob and Patrick won the wrestling arena, guess what? They have a choice between winning all of that money or they go to Wrestle Camp. And guess what they chose? Wrestle Camp. So that means since SpongeBob and Patrick chose Wrestle Camp over all that money, they vacuumed all the money and Mr. Krabs, you know, he didn't get the money he want and which good for him, that's what he gets for using SpongeBob and Patrick. Overall guys, I really, really enjoyed Krusty Crusher because the writers definitely were very fully realized on what this episode is all about. That's probably what made this a very solid episode in my opinion. I was entertained from start to finish and that's why I'm going to give Krusty Crushers a 7.5 out of 10. So you guys, in the comments down below, let me know what you think of the episode Krusty Crushers. This is 22 Tiger Dude here, and don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power!